I still remember that day. The day when my mother brought me something. I was shocked when she brought me a book. I know we could not afford it, so I refused. But she insisted that I should keep it. I still remember this as one of my unforgettable memories in my life. Oh, what are you reading? Uh, Lord, this is a story about inheritance. Mm -hmm. Do you know, Apo? Uh, back in the day, we did own a land. But sadly, something unfortunate happened. I was illiterate, and they took advantage of that. They took our land with a contract I didn't know about. I was pleading non-stop for them to return our land, but it was to no avail. If only I was not rash and thought it through, maybe I could have saved our inheritance and still regret it to this day. Jose, follow me. I need to show you something. Mom? Let's go. One of the highlights of my life was when one of my teachers opened a library. This is where my passion for literature really ignited. This is also where I realized the injustice many face up until now. I decided to drop out to pursue my passion and honestly it was probably one of the best decisions I have made. Receiving the approval for the PEN organization was undoubtedly one of the most proudest moments of my life. Establishing my PEN organization was a long and challenging process, but it was worth it to see my vision come to life. The approval of my organization gave me the confidence and motivation to continue pursuing my passion for making a positive impact 
in my community. I am grateful for the support of my team and mentors who helped me navigate the application process and achieve this accomplishment. It wasn't an easy journey. It was full of obstacles. But it made me realize something that all of these are the fruits of my hard work and dedication. I have grown stronger and more resilient because of the challenges I faced along the way. I now have a greater appreciation for the value of perseverance and the rewards that come with it. And welcome Mr. Francisco Soniel Jose who have garnered and earned the National Artist Award for his works and contribution to the world of literature who also have been an inspiration to many. Let us give them a round of applause. I wanted to thank all of you for supporting me in this journey. I don't know how many of you are already married. To Sulu, I went to Mindanao, kung saan saan ako pumupunta. But I'm they didn't get that fortune through writing, through inheritance. Tinawag, tinawag niya ako sa pisina niya na, if you saw Miss Roses, she, she has this sourpuss mien eh, kala mo na palaging galit eh. 